Yes. Hey guys, in today's video I'm going to show you the progress of Nairobi Expressway, especially along Uhuru Highway. I, I'm also going to tell you more about what my friend's reactions were about Nairobi when he, he landed in Kenya after living in the United States for over 7 years. Don't forget to like, it helps me get more and I can continue preaching the gospel of prosperous Africa to the world. Comment below if you are watching from diaspora and the country you are watching from or state in case of USA. Otherwise, I am your one and only Dennis the National. So before I tell you about my friends' reactions and opinions of Nairobi, I would like to talk about I would like to talk slightly about Nairobi Expressway for those who have no idea about the road. Nairobi Expressway is a four-lane dual carriageway which will run over 27 kilometers, linking Mlulongo Town in Machakos County and Jomo Kenyatta International Airport along Mombasa Road to Waiyakiwe in Westlands. The expressway is part of the Northern corridor that provides passage to 85% of cargo destined for neighboring landlocked countries such as Uganda, Rwanda, DRC, and Southern Sudan. The highway is a partnership between the Kenyan government and China Roads and Bridge Corporation from China, which will construct, maintain, and operate the road for 27 years, during which it will charge and collect toll fees from vehicles using the road. Each vehicle will pay between 100 and 1,500 Kenyan shillings depending on the size of the vehicle and distance traveled. Comment below what you think about the toll fees prices. Now, my friend landed at JKA at around 10 a.m. He had been to the USA for over seven years. He went as a student and later secured a job as an engineer. He had always watched my videos about Nairobi City infrastructure developments and always missed home. But the moment we, start, we, the moment we started driving from JKA and joined the Mombasa Road, he noticed something different. Something had changed from the time he left. The Nairobi Expressway, he said, felt like Dubai and USA where, where such roads exist. All I could tell him is that it's time for Africa. He was so hopeful that the rapid transformation of Kenya and Nairobi, especially infrastructure-wise, will make Kenya a higher middle-income country and take it on top of the world. He also noticed the skyscrapers of Upper Hill, CBD and Westlands and marveled at the high speed of which the city had transformed in a short span of time. He promised to heed my call for Kenyans in diaspora to invest home and create employment and economic development. He finally promised to move back to Kenya, saying after all the years abroad, his heart has always and will always be in Kenya. So guys, I'm going to drive all the way to uh, Nyayo Roundabout so that you, that you can see the progress of the Uhuru Highway, uh, Nairobi Expressway construction. Uh, I'm also going to show you the Nyayo Roundabout and Interchange, how it looks, and a little bit of Mombasa Road. I hope you guys enjoy this, this ride, and don't forget to like and subscribe, like I said, when you like. I get more and more views. I've done so many videos about Nairobi, Kenya and many many other projects. Like, subscribe and also I'd like to say a special thank you to those who watched my my Nairobi Kisumu train video. The video right now has over 60,000 views you know, in under 6 days. I am so thankful and humbled. I know I will go far by doing this and I know I have to do it better and better each day. I know I have to get better at this so that you guys can also enjoy enjoy watching this to my friends in diaspora thank you for always supporting me you can still support me and leave my details below you know every time you support me either on patreon or you send me something it helps me make more and more videos like this and i can also travel wide and outside nairobi maybe in mombasa lamu and other places few people have traveled below because my love my love and passion for youtube is to show kenya to the world and i want to do this in a way that most of you will, will also enjoy watching this remember equipments used to make these videos are very expensive and i have to buy them one one at a time so that this experience can also be amazing for you guys otherwise enjoy the whole video enjoy the views and thank you guys